Good morning, Phil from Warhammer Club Aston again. Hope everyone's okay. Now, a bit of an update on the British Paratroopers uh, project for bolt action that I'm busy with. I've uh, got the truck built. It's a cool little model. I've done a little head swap on the model for the driver. The body I didn't want to swap with a Paratroopers body because they're actually a little bit smaller than uh, the bolt action models. But the head yeah, looks okay. It's a little bit bigger than the body, but yeah, it'll do. And the uh, gunner, I did swap the body with. So he actually fits really nicely with his pose. I don't know if I can do this and see on camera. He fits nicely where he should fit with his feet on the back of the seat and on the front of the window. And then uh, obviously he will get the LMG glued on. And that will go here on the ring. I uh, left the back open. There's options for open tops with canopy, uh, all the back closed, open, and uh, also seats. So I put the seats in to give it a bit of detail inside, show how far I can get in there with a the paintbrush. Uh, the detail's really good. The model is lovely to build, but I think I made a mistake because they say it's ABS plastic. Um, the plastic glue that I use is from Citadel and I don't know if it's going to work on the ABS plastic. Uh, I guess I'll see, you know, we'll see how it goes. Then um, I've got then my uh, Piat team. There is my, no, sorry. This is my Piat team. And I've got the loader, and I've got Mr. Man with his Piat in his hand. Uh, yeah, that's them guys. The HQ build. They didn't take any work. You know, there's a radio guy. The medic. I'm looking at making somebody that looks like he's down, injured. This is the uh, observer, I believe. And then. Uh, the lieutenant nice models lovely nice and clean not a lot of work to do and then i've got a 10 man rifle squad to yeah and i've test painted one of them uh, i think with my painting skills i'm actually really happy with him uh, there's a couple of little mistakes but i'll be okay yeah, you know, quite happy with that. Need to order top up my paints, but be okay. There's the sergeant for the unit, and then obviously I've done um, LNG and the loader is somewhere. So I don't know. There is a loader in here somewhere. There he is there. With his binos. Oh, he's now dead. Um, so that's the first squad. And then I've been talking to some of the guys in the group here in Holland. And they seem to think that the best thing to do is to have some small squads to go in a, a Bren gun carrier. So I've got another small squad here. I've got the sergeant with his SMG. And then I've got uh four more guys with smgs and i've got a normal rifle guy um got an lmg team to go with them the general consensus is not to mix an lmg team in an smg squad uh long range short range and all that moving um so i think i'll use these uh in the next squad and i'll have another rifle squad uh, maybe to go in the truck, or maybe I'll put the truck with these guys. I haven't decided yet. Uh, I've figured out what my next order will be. I'm pretty sure I'm going to order two Bren gun carriers and um, a tank. I'm not sure what tank I want. I think it's going to be a Cromwell, but I'm also pushed towards a British Sherman. 
Um, let me know in the comments below what you think. I'm not sure. Um, I quite like the Shermans, but the Cromwell is quite a quick tank. Can keep up with the rest of the troops. Can maybe go left and right where uh, needed. Today's project will be to get these little bags of metal parts opened and see uh, see what I can build there. I've got the Vickers MG and the Light March and the Flamethrower team. So uh, I shall open one of these bags today and get building. Thank you for listening. Um, like I said, the videos will be short. I'm not going to do any building videos, just like a work in progress. See how we're getting on. If you guys want any more content from me, let me know. If I can change anything, alter anything, let me know. I bought a stand for my uh, telephone to make the videos a little bit more stable. So uh, let me know. Uh, thanks for now. See you later. Bye-bye.